this is our ultimate den, which we've designed based on Ethna's drawings. Ethna's the winner of the ultimate den competition. Um, we really liked her designs, thought she had some really, really cool things in it. So this is our first mock-up that we've done of Ethna's den. Um, one of the things that really struck us from the start was Ethna's bright orange slides. So we've tried to incorporate that. This is some slides that we had made especially to work on this model. The finished ones might look slightly different. This model is made completely out of card, so it's not perfect, but that's part of the design process and that making mistakes is good because you learn from your mistakes. And we made a lot of mistakes, so hopefully we'll have figured out all the problems by the time we get it done. So we've got our slide here, so Lottie can slide down on the slide from the roof, just like Ethna had in her drawing. She slides down around the side and she'll have a cool little tunnel to slide inside the building here. On the front door, all good castles should have a drawbridge, so we made a drawbridge. So that works. I think that's kind of cool. On the other side we've got the roof just like Ethna had in her drawing. The red roof and on the inside Ethna had a library. So we've got Ethna's library in here. We thought it would be really cool if the library, like all good castles, had a secret door. So it's got a secret door hidden inside the library shelves. So Lottie can sneak in and out with her friends in her ultimate den. Also that was in Ethna's drawing is a indoor swing. We liked that because it meant that they could swing inside even when it was raining inside in their den. So we've incorporated one of those in there. And the other main component on Ethna's drawing was her art room. So in her art room we're going to have a blackboard wall which means that even when she doesn't have paper and things she can just draw on the walls because it's their den, it's not like their house they're able to draw on the walls and their parents won't go mad. Um, we've got the little play area up here for pets, they like to play up in the height. And then another thing that we incorporated in that wasn't in Ethna's drawing was the climbing wall. We had some ladders but we thought it would be kind of cool if we could change it into sort of like a climbing wall on the side so a lot of you can climb up the side of the building holding on to the various holes that's on the climbing wall. That's kind of cool. Let's say this isn't the finished product yet so hopefully we'll have all the kinks worked out by the time we're done. And then another cool feature that we added that a lot of the kids had in their drawings for the ultimate den was the zip line. Like so many kids had a zip line, so we thought everybody wants a zip line, so we better add a zip line. So again, this is only a test test model that we've made it. I made it in here in the office out of an old coat hanger and pencil, you can see it. So hopefully the finished product lot will be able to sit on the swing and slide down on their zip line. All the way to the bottom. And at the moment that's basically everything we have on our ultimate den. This is our first attempt at trying to translate Ethna's drawings into a cool ultimate den castle. So at the moment we're going to send these off to the factory and get one made up in wood and when that comes back we'll be at the next stage and we'll be able to work out some more of the kinks and we should have the finished product.